Happening now, Clemson University is going Hollywood, or rather Hollywood, is coming to Clemson. Crews working for Disney Studios started blocking off certain areas of the campus for a movie shoot. Trailers, you can see there, of equipment arriving today, too. Our filming is set to begin Sunday for the new film Safety, based on the life of former Clemson football player Ray Ray McElrath Bay. Fox Carolina's Matt Koufax got an exclusive look and joins us live in studio with more on this cool event. Yeah, Tori, it is really cool. You could feel the excitement in the air and Ray Ray played football for the Tigers back in 2006 and the producer of the movie, Mark Charty, tells me they plan to make things as authentic to that uh, time period, we should say, as possible. The crew will film at iconic locations all around campus. We're talking the Esso Club, the Cooper Library, the Reflection Pond, and it'll all culminate, of course, at the stadium in a halftime scene shot live at the next home game in Death Valley. And all around campus, the buzz is growing. When the Tigers take the field September 21st, players and fans under the lights will feel them shine brighter than ever. It was a well-known story, and to see it kind of come full circle now with a motion picture is really exciting. Ray Ray McElrath Bay famously adopted his 11-year-old brother from their family's broken home while playing for the Tigers in the mid-2000s. Now his inspirational story becomes legend on the silver screen. Disney's actually reached out to a number of different student organizations by my understanding. Uh, wanting extras and some uh, actors in, in paid roles. And students are pumped. Yeah, I think that's really cool. Like, I've never had that opportunity before. Ainsley Fenninger and Abby Woods are both freshmen who bleed orange and think the timing couldn't be more perfect. We now have all this attention because we did win the national championship, and now everybody's kind of looking at Clemson, and this can highlight a different point in time for us. Disney crews say they're going to try and blend in seamlessly. Building access that could be restricted, you could certainly see some parking affected by it as well, so we really appreciate patience on the part of students, faculty, and staff. It all comes to a head during halftime on the 21st when producers say they'll take the field live for seven minutes running kickoffs and scripted plays. We encourage all fans to stay in their seats at halftime and just really make a great environment. You'll be able to find the complete list of building closures and traffic patterns for those 10 days of filming inside our Fox Carolina News app. The film's producer tells me that after Clemson, they'll push off to Atlanta to finish shooting. shooting. They're set to wrap everything on November 15th, but he says he can't say enough about the fun that he knows they're about to have at the school. He says the partnership has been fantastic. And then we wait for it to be released on Disney's new Disney Plus platform. Tori, back to you.